Action Jackson. Um, here's another part of my F Space documentary, and this one is about a theme, and it's called it's a common theme that everybody can associate with, and uh, it's called love, obviously. L O V E for those who don't know how to spell. But it's called love and I'm gonna talk about it for this whole entire video and um, probably I probably talk about past experiences um, and what do I notice and what pisses me off and what pisses other people off I guess not just me and uh, all right so obviously um, Everybody usually loves someone in their lifetime. Um, girl, boy, dog, cat, some type of weird thing. I don't know. Um, but relationships and love and it could be uh, good and bad, I would say. Mostly good if, they have, if you fall in love with someone. If you like someone it's a good thing if you get your heart broken well it's the bad part but it's either the good or the bad it's usually no in between and yeah for me my past experiences um I want to be truthful and honest um just really it's not been that it's not been that great. Um, where I live in Connecticut, um, I haven't really found anybody. Uh, maybe if I go out more or something, I probably could. Um, but my town, particularly, um, <laughs> there's nothing really. Not to say that there isn't good people, but nothing's worked for me so far. Um, I do go to school, I go to college, as most of you know. Some of you may not know, I do go to college. I, some of you don't know that, it's because my face looks like I'm 15, 14, but I'm really not 15 or 14. I'm older. Not that much older, but I'm older. <laughs> um, but, you know, go to school. I gotta say, there is some... Go to the community college. I don't go to the university because I never had the grades to go um, to university. Didn't take the SAT because I knew where I was going. <laughs> um, quite frankly, you don't really need to go to university to get to what you want in life. But, alright, so I do go to school, and the girls there, or the woman, I should say, because use both terms um the pretty that's for sure obviously the mature some aren't it's the way it goes but they're really pretty and um there's a few that I kind of like have a crush on but obviously if you want to be realis realistic nothing's gonna happen so I don't even approach them or talk to them uh, to be honest with you, I don't even know their names. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know their names, but uh, they seem like good people. So Kim Kardashian look like, and um, sort of look like she's really gorgeous, really pretty. But you know, be realistic here. Nothing's gonna happen. That's possibly my fault because I don't approach women. But, um, yeah. The other girl, she's pretty too. And, uh, she seems nice. She seems shy, though. I'm sort of shy, believe it or not. So, she's too shy people usually don't work out too well. 
at first. But yeah. So. Here are some love pictures. Comment. So, put in some pictures just to mix it up so you don't hear my voice the whole entire time. But like I was saying, there's this, there's the school, and uh, I know, I do like people from there, but again, I want to be realistic, unless I change my ways, which I probably won't, nothing's going to happen, and maybe I should grow up, not grow up, but step up, and uh, Make something happen. Whatever. <laughs> um, but yeah. Alright, so we'll talk about so that. Get through that. Now, we'll talk about the online relationship. Um, people do long distance through the internet. Online. Um,. I would say if you pull most people that do it, it doesn't work. But I think it makes it much more special if it does work. Um, the relationship. But I don't know. It's, it's a tricky situation. If I liked people through the computer, the internet, talk to people online, yeah, I have liked people. Um, there's no doubt about it. And, um, I'm not gonna, I don't wanna say any names in this video. Um, because, just for respect out of them. Um, I've had a, I felt hard for one person, but, um, they completely lied, backstabbed. Um, I don't talk to them no more. And, uh, that one hurt a little bit. Um, but, you know, so with my luck, yeah, I almost expect it. Um, there's another girl. Um, I loved her. And I don't know. Did that one ended kind of weird. Um, my love for her. You know, also love her as a friend, but obviously we don't go out. Um, I don't really want to give them too much details because these people probably watch my videos. One of them does, and I prefer not to get into it, but I wanted to mention that people do go out online. And it's not easy. It really isn't. But if you be able to make it work, it makes it that much more special. And I don't think there's anything wrong with that either. It's just another method. Face to face, it's more traditional, but I don't know. I May mean, not. It's not for everybody. Some people want the online. Some people aren't compatible near each other, like in that area. So they gotta go outside the box, and there's nothing wrong with that. So we shouldn't be ashamed. You know, see that on TV. I saw it's like the catfish thing, whatever. It was on MTV recently. I just saw. It. I guess a guy was supposed to meet up with like some really hot blonde woman. And uh, some uh, obese woman. <laughs> She's kind of big, and uh, she poses somebody else. And that's the problem, I think. Um, I think people are fake. And uh, when it, you know, there's some people that are fake like that, and I just I don't agree with it. I think fakeness is a horrible quality, and it's stupid. And if you're acting fake, then you're not a you're not really a person. Like. Uh, Absolutely, you are a person, but you just go away. <laughs> uh, I just hate fake people. When I just don't like it. I don't care for them. I don't think nobody does. So I mentioned, all right. So I mentioned the college. Or I mentioned school love. There's kind of two things right there. And then I mentioned the online and my past experience with that. Um, but basically, that's just you know. 
it's just me. Uh, I don't have the best luck when it comes to girls. Um, I don't know. I've, again, I've had so many chances to go out with people, but my shyness has gotten in the way. And I don't step up to the plate. And some say, grow some balls. Well, I do have balls, but this is just not really my type of personality to ask somebody out. There's nothing wrong with doing that. I don't think there's anything wrong with a girl asking a guy out either. I think that's uh, over overrated about saying, oh, guys ask. Guys are supposed to ask out girls. Not girls supposed to ask out guys. Well, no, girls can do that too. What the hell is so wrong with that? There's nothing wrong with that. So, it's kind of stupid. Anything, girls will not get rejected. <laughs> so, guy would be happy to hear that unless he was going out with someone and he says no, obviously. So there is that too. Another key point. I'm not a therapist or relationship doctor or anything like that, but I'm just giving my observations and some stuff. Um, what else do I want to mention? I really can't. I think it's pretty much a three some major points. Um, I don't know. For personally me, like I said, I could have gone out with a lot of people, and if I asked some people to two girls out at school, I'd probably get a no, to be honest, but I should ask them, but I won't, because it's just me, and that's fine, you know, it's over, it's not over, it's not, like, it's okay to be single, it's not, you don't need to be in a relationship, if you're not ready, you're not ready, or if you're not in one, you're not in one, you've got all your life to do that, so not a necessity but for some people it is and it's understandable because they want to be with someone and um, yeah so um, I do you know personally again I do get a lot of looks like people looking at me and stuff not like oh man he's ugly unless I ugly to some people which it could be I understand that you know, whatever. <laughs> I don't really care, but, you know, and it's good to get, you know, people looking at you. At least, you know, you're doing something right. You get attention, too. Um, you know, like, when I go to the mall and stuff, I notice people, like, look at me and stuff. The corner of my eye, I see them. Or at school. I don't know, that kind of makes me feel good, happy. Um, it's kind of silly to say that, but, at least to me it does. You know, it doesn't make me feel like a pile of shit or worthless. So yeah. Um, I think that's pretty much it. I don't know, I just, you know, I think love's important, but don't make it out to be the most important thing ever because it comes and goes. Hopefully it stays for some for most people. Hopefully. You're always going to have something wrong with it, like a breakup or something. But I think in the long run, it will be all right. And my phone's ringing. But somebody keeps calling at 5.05 each fucking day. It's annoying. But that's pretty much it. I hope you enjoy this video. I know it's long. You hear me talk, but I think it's important. I really need to get this out. I really need to talk about it because I always do like talking about it. Sometimes it hurts, but gotta be said and uh, I do mean it from the bottom of the heart of what I say when it comes to love and um, relationships and stuff like that so I hope you like this um, watch my other videos and sub to my channel because I come out with some good stuff a lot of random stuff also tumblr twitter facebook skype whatever um, hope you enjoy this and feel free to message me or whatever and we can talk about anything, I don't really care. So, yeah, hope you like this. There's a heart. <laughs> but, bye-bye. <laughs>